Welcome to Hello Class. I'm Alan, your teacher. Today we are talking about animals. Let's start with pets. Pets are animals that live in your home. Now what happens if someone asks you, have any? And the answer's no. For example, have any snakes? What's the answer? The answer is, no, I have none. Let's practice the answer. No, I have none. You say it. Good, now I'll ask you the question and you answer with, no, I have none. Have any snakes? Let's try it again. Have any snakes? Now I'm going to ask you some questions about pets. Remember, if someone says, have any dogs? You can either say, yes, I have a dog, or no, I have none. Let's try it. Have any dogs? Good. Have any cats? I like cats too. Have any fish? Did you say, yes, I have a fish? Or no, I have none. Here is another animal people have as a pet. This is a rabbit. Rabbit. Say rabbit. Again, rabbit. One more time. Rabbit. That's right. A rabbit has long ears and soft fur. A rabbit hops very quickly. How about birds? Have any birds? Birds sing beautifully. Have any snakes? Me neither. Well, excellent. Now you've learned to answer the question, have any pets? Excellent. Now that you know about house pets, let's talk about animals that live on a farm. This is a chicken. Chickens lay eggs. Chicken. You say it, chicken. Great! It's a chicken. Here is a horse. Some people like to ride horses. You say the word horse. Horse. Good! It's a horse. This is a pig. Pigs have curly tails. You say pig. Again, pig. Great job! Here is a cow. Cows are used for milk or beef. Say the word cow. Cow. Great job! Here is a sheep. Sheep. We make sweaters out of sheep's wool. Say the word sheep. Good. This is a goat. Goat. Some people prefer goat's milk to cow's milk. Say the word goat. 
Good. Now that you know the names of the animals that live on the farm, let's learn the sound they make. A chicken says, bark, bark, bark. Chicken. Chicken. A horse says, nay. Horse. Horse. A pig says, oink, oink. Pig. Pig. A sheep says, ba. Sheep. Sheep. A cow says, moo. Cow. Cow. A goat says, nee. Nee. Goat. Goat. Let's play a game. I'll make the animal noise, and you name the animal. Are you ready? Nay. Nay. Did you guess a horse? You are right. How about this one? Yes, it's a goat. Let's try another one. Ba. Ba. Sure, it's a sheep. Moo. Moo. It's a cow. Bark, bark, bark. Bark, bark, bark. It's a chicken. Okay, I'm going to mix them up again. Oink, oink, oink. Pig. Nay. Horse. Moo. Cow. Nay. Goat. What's left? Buck, buck, buck. Chicken. Well done. You know the names of so many animals. Let's talk about animals you find at a zoo. This is a lion. Some people call the lion the king of the beasts. A male lion has a big mane of hair on its head. You say the word lion. Lion. Say it again. Lion. Great job. Lion. Here is a tiger. A tiger is one of the biggest cats on earth. It has black and orange stripes. Say the word tiger. Tiger. Good job, tiger. This is a rhinoceros. That's a long word. Let's take it slow. Rhinoceros. Rhinoceros. You say it. Say it again. Rhinoceros. Good job. This is an elephant. Elephants are known for their strong trunks and large ears. You say the word elephant. Elephant. Great job. This is a giraffe. Giraffe. Giraffes have long necks for eating leaves out of trees. 
Say the word giraffe. Giraffe. Good. It's a giraffe. Here is a hippopotamus. That's another long word. Hippopotamus. You try it. Hippopotamus. Very good. Hippopotamus. Now you know some of the names of the animals you might see in a zoo. I'll show you a picture of an animal and you tell me the name. What's this? It's a lion, right. Say it one more time. Lion. Good. What's this? It's a hippopotamus. Hippopotamus. What's this? Did you say tiger? Say it again. Tiger. How about this big animal? Elephant. Great job. Say it again. Elephant. It has a long neck. Giraffe. Right. Say giraffe. Here's another one. Rhinoceros. That's a long one. Say that word again. Rhinoceros. Great. Well done. You're learning many new words in English. I hope you'll join us next time for more Hello Class.